everyone, Zach Greenway here again at Performance Sport and Spine, and today we're going to talk about squatting and a common thing I see in the clinic with some of my patients and some ways to address that with different cues. So I think it's common that when people squat, they really want to keep a bunch of extension or arcing of their back to be protective of your back. But the thing is, is that when you squat, your back is going to flex some no matter how straight you think it is, and that excessively extending it or arching it limits your range of motion because your pelvis rolls anteriorly and starts to get compressed into these anterior structures and it turns into this kind of good morning squat and then standing up sometimes it can be a lumbar motion rather than driving with your hips so what we're going to work on today is a cue that can help build strength lower and initialize more of a hip centric motion than a lumbar motion so a great way to do this is to get a box this one's 18 inches and then get a bar with relatively light weight. So if you're the kind of person that when you squat, the first motion is this, that's okay. So we're going to squat down. Your back's going to feel stiff, but in this motion, you're going to pull your ribs under and then drive up with your hips. And you're going to feel a much different motion because it's going to be more glutes and quads. So again, if you're going, your back starts to arch, go down, tuck, drive up, slow. Once you've done this a few times, you might be able to even start controlling it more on the eccentric portion as well as the concentric portion. So the next step would be to either go down, find your position, come up, pause, and stand all the way up, or just go down, slow, reconnect, up, slow. Once you feel like you've mastered this range of motion, the next step is to put the bar down, get rid of the box, and then work on your depth. Often people find that their depth increases because they're able to utilize their hip anatomy better. So again, tuck, go down till you're comfortable, pause, stand up, do the hips. Tuck, pause, stand up, do the hips. Now this isn't meant to be fixed in one session, but this should give you a path to be able to break the habit of excessive guarding, which will utilize your glutes more, as well as in this motion, you should be able to drop down into the squat better. Let us know if you have any comments.